Hi guys, it's Dawn from Let's Make a Mess Today. How are you doing? Well, welcome to the third Wednesday of the month. This is my crap, whatever crap I want to do day. And today I just wanted to do an art journal page. I've got a lot of stuff going on. So I thought, well, I'll just do a quick little art page. And it's something that I wanted to do anyway. Um, because, well, you'll, you'll see in a minute. But so for those that are new, the first Wednesday of the month is our giveaway slash... Um, Happy Meal um, video. The second Wednesday of the month is our Fatty Patty. The third Wednesday of the month is our Craft With Me. So art page, whatever I feel like doing. And the fourth Wednesday of the month is our live. So I'll be streaming next Wednesday live. And I'm going to probably be doing a Fatty Patty Christmas because I've had a um, you know suggestion for that or a request for that. So we're going to probably be doing Fatty Patty Christmas next, next week. So we'll start getting in on the Christmas things. Um, also, I just wanted to say thank you to everybody and let you and remind you that I've started this thing called buy me a cup of coffee. The link is down below. So if you want to buy me a cup of coffee, if, if that is a successful thing, and if I, if I can get enough support that way, then I won't have to go towards, um, doing a, um, you know, um, uh, what do you call it? Uh, oh my gosh. I just, sorry. Here, hold on. Let me have another sip. Maybe my mind will be joggled but you know where you just do a membership thing and i'll put some of my videos so they're private and only the people that pay for it can see that so if i get enough cups of coffee i won't do that so just let, just to let you know so here cheers let's have a sip let's be positive tonight uh -huh. uh -uh -uh. you guys know what that is right for those of you that don't know me that is vodka and cran cherry but it's diet cran cherry i don't know why um, I just remembered something. Let me be right. I'll be right back. It's sweater weather here in Eugene. And so I'm putting my little sweater on my finger. I have a finger, a sweater. My, my finger has its own little sweater now. <laughs> anyway, so I like having that on there. It keeps my, my knuckle, um, stable. So let's just move on. We don't need to talk about that. So, all right. So also today, I just wanted to pick something out of my, this book. I love this book. I picked this up. It's called a New York Lookbook, and I love this book. So basically, it is a bunch of really cool pictures, you guys. I mean, really fun. Look at this. Isn't she cute? Just great pictures for your art. They're not just your regular models. They're very cool-looking pictures, right? Check this out. These guys have masks on. Ooh, I think I'm using that one today. Not this side, but that one, because he's actually wearing a mask. And I am trying, I'm going to pull that out of there, because I my whole message today is trying to stay um, positive, even though we're still, we're going back under, you guys, a lockdown. So <sighs> I just thought, well, I'm going to do something positive now, because, you know, if we can just get through this, but look at these. Before I start talking about that, look at these really cool images in this book. And so if you're interested in this book, I did find it on Amazon. And there's a link to my Amazon shop down below. So you can get it there. I think when I linked it, I said they thought there was like three left or something. Um, isn't he handsome? He looks like looks like Prince to me. He's a high school student. So, oh my gosh, shame on me. And look at her. Isn't she cool? All right, so let me tell you what this is about. So let's just pick one. Okay, here, so here's one. So this is a New York lookbook. It's the Gallery of Street Fashion. And let's take a look at her. This is a student, Kasuko Akawa. And this is a student. And what brought you to New York? And to New York. And he said, I wanted to study fashion, so I came three years ago. I enjoyed New York. But in Japan, everything makes sense more. Here it's more exciting with all the drama and the troubles. You know what's funny about this is Japan has really way better street fashion in my opinion but i mean i'm not a big fashionista or anything but i do love the japan street wear um so then it basically just asks a lot of questions about now he says the drama what do you mean and then he talks about the drama basically um it just kind of what picture you have here it gives you a rundown of that person like this is louis edala and it says, how do you describe your style? And he says, you're thinking that someone who looks like me deliberately does a certain style. I don't. Not at all. He goes, I will tell you about the shoes that I've got. And, you know, and then he goes on to talk about his mustache and what kind of lawyer is he. Is he. Um, 
and you know so this is just a really cool book and i just thought i would share with you and pick out of this book today and so let's move on from that so again this is down in my amazon shop if you are interested in it i love this book i like magazines and you know those kind of things but i also just love books like this so today i wanted to do an art page you know that speaks to the fact that we're moving back into you know the government governors are closing down the shops again and it's really getting hard and it's getting tedious and we're all getting covid burnout so i just wanted to do something about that so this one says wait don't give up give up something great is about to happen uh, be strong now because things will get better it might be stormy now but it can't rain forever i don't know which one of these i'm going to use i just um, went on pinterest and found a few and this says, even the darkest night will end and the sun will rise. And it says, it can only break you if you let it. So I think I am going to use this and because they, they look like they fit pretty well in here. Yeah, so let's cut this out. Let's just start with that. Get my handy dandy scissors. Wait a minute, though. Got to have a sip of this. So I hope you guys are all doing fairly well. No, I hope you're doing not fairly well. I hope you're doing really well. I'm doing okay. Um, not going to chat too much. I mean, you know me, I'm going to chat, but um, I save most of my personal chatty chat chat for my fatty patties, which again, I think next Wednesday we'll be doing a fatty patty Christmas because I pulled her out. Someone says, are you going to be doing your fatty patty Christmas? I said, absolutely. And I went, well, wait, where is it? You know, I knew it was with my Christmas stuff. Not not, not my home Christmas stuff, but my, my, my crafty Christmas stuff. So I went and um, pulled it out. And now I'm very excited. Okay, you guys, I'm going to go ahead and speed through this so you don't have to cut this out with me and I don't have to bore you with my chat. So I'm just going to go ahead and cut this out and you can watch. Okay, so these are the Fly Guy Saunders, and they just have a style. The whole style is basically geek style, like we got stuffed in a locker because we were real smart and the lenses of our glasses get knocked out. <laughs> How'd you come up with it? We were watching the French, Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, and Will Smith had some weird style in like 86, 87. We're like, damn, we do the same shit, just like him. <laughs> Yeah, they do have that kind of vibe, don't they, guys? Fresh prints. Okay, so let's get back to cutting. Like a bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time, it's clear to see From up here, the world seems small We can sit Okay guys, I will be right back. I gotta get rid of the graciness. Well, first off, before we go, let's decide what, um, what page and maybe again this is in my amazon shop if you're interested um so let's take a look at these guys and see what page maybe what what uh oh my god they fit perfect don't they they're like awesomeness awesome sauce well like that so there's that and she's sitting right on my my uh oh here baby come on oh sorry here let me, there we go. It can only break you if you let it. I like that one. Don't give up. Something great is about to happen. I like that one too. I'm, I think I'm not into painting again today. I think I'm just going to do some other stuff. So I'll be right back with some other stuff. Be right back, guys. All right, I am back. I found some uh, deli paper 
Now, I don't think this was my deli paper. I actually think somebody out there in Make a Mess Land sent this to me. So I'm thanking you for, for giving this to me. But I'm going to go ahead and go over this masking tape right here with a little bit of um, my jot. Now, you could be using, um, you know, uh, what do you call it? Mod Podge or any of those golden golden matte medium or whatever, but I am just going to use Jot right now because that's how I'm I roll right now. I'm being a little lazy, but I just want to get get this in here and and uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to add paint or not. I probably won't. I'm not feeling the painty kind of messy mood today right now. But you never know. Never say never say never. You know me. Never say never. So, I'm going to fold that over. Okay. Uh, this book, I made this book, for those of you that are interested. It's made out of two canvas canvases, painting canvases, and a small canvas here. It's got sewn signatures right here with four signatures. And it's held together, you know, with this kind of a binding. So, um, there is an art canvas journal page how-to playlist. Um, I can try to link that down below for you. So if I can do that, I will. Well, I mean, I can do that. It's just a matter of doing it, I guess. Oh, I actually want to leave these out so you can see them. I think I'm going to go ahead and put this here. Let's see. And then I really love this color here, though. So I love that. It's kind of blocky, isn't it? But maybe it'll do. Oh, that didn't work. That didn't work very well. Let's try this again. There we go. That's all I want. That's all I wanted. And then put that there. So see when you can just do a quick art page just to get a message out of your um, you know out of your brain and onto a piece of paper into your art journal. You know, and uh, it's just a quick little j art journal, you know. You don't have to spend hours and, you know, lots of, um, you know, techniques and stuff. You can just use, I mean, you already spent your hours and your techniques on your um, painting papers uh, and that kind of thing. So just use them now and um, enjoy them. So that's what I'm doing with this art page. I'm using what I have, what I've been given, what I've been gifted and what I've created, and um, yeah, so there's that, maybe I like this one, I'm trying to see, or I still like this one, I still just really like this one, yeah, we're going to use this one, let me see something, okay, okay, let's go ahead and look that, Boy, this deli paper is going down nicely. Really nicely. can't wait to chat with you next week. I have lots to talk about. <laughs> lots going on. I mean, good stuff, not bad stuff. And not, not terribly exciting, but just, just normal everyday stuff. Oh, I love the way this jelly paper, this jelly plate is going down. Jelly plate. This deli paper is going down really well. Love it. Now this, you know, is my journal that I'm keeping forever and ever and going to give my daughter. So I probably should be using better jot or better glue stick. But you know, I love this glue stick. And so this is, and that looks good because they look like they're standing on a platform. Doesn't that look like they're in a room there? I actually, I'm going to put them here because it looks like this is the floor, you know, and that's the wall, doesn't it? I mean, this looks good too, but I think I'm going to put them there. And put my words here. Which did I decide? Not these. 
It can only break you if you let it, I think. I think those are the words I decided to use. Well, yes. Oh, we can rip these. Hang on. And to this, I'm speaking about the COVID. The COVID. A lot of people don't like to talk about it on their channel, but... It's here, guys. It's not going anywhere for a while, though. Better get used to it. For a while, anyway. We can break it. We can win this thing. We can, we can. We got this. I need to get one of those rip rulers. Anybody know where... I guess you can just get them on Amazon. I better put, buy one put one in my shop. <laughs> They're really cool. They make the edges look like you've ripped them without ripping them. You know what I mean? Do you know? And this book goes to Lauren someday. When I'm finished with it, she gets to have it. So it's going to be a lot of just art pages like this. Quick and... Um, kind of, you know, kind of a message of the day, if you know what I mean, to represent the, what we're going through right now. It's not like she's not going through it too. She's 21. Definitely. I can't believe the kids these days, how hard it is for them. I really can't. But you guys got this, you guys. I got faith in you. You're tough cookies. You're tough cookies. You can do this. Boy, just think how much fun we're going to have when it's over. Woohoo! <laughs> My goodness. My goodness. We are going to have so much fun when this crap is gone. Oh. It's going to be like next next year. It's going to be a good year, you guys. Come on. we You know that, right? We got this. We got this. We got this, we got this. Now this is a little, um, what do you call it, cardboardy. So I'm going to go ahead and use my Aileen's on this. And so I'm going to put a little bit of Aileen's on here. And then I'm going to squish it around with my finger. Or, you know, something, I don't know. And I'm not careful about my sides or anything, you guys. I'm really, 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 really bad about the edges of stuff. So, I apologize in advance. I'll try to get it to the edges. What's this? We don't want that. Let's use... Oh, that's cute. That pretty little bird. Pretty little bird. Okay, yeah. So, you go like this and you'll get it to the edges. I'm using the back of this deli paper, but it'll be fine. It's going to be fine. You know me. No drama. No stress allowed. Okay, boys. See, he's got his little foot on here. Yeah, I feel like he's going to have to come up a little bit. Hmm. I feel like I should put some yellow here. I feel like I should put another thing in yellow. Oh, well, I'm the only one who noticed it now and you. So, yeah, we're good. We're good. Yeah, they do have that Fresh Prince of Bel-Air vibe going on, don't they? Remember Urkel? Oh, God, that guy was annoying. <laughs> Not gonna lie. I wasn't really a fan. But the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, you want to hear a story? Oh my God, I have a story about the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. His brother. What was the guy's name? The, the fancy pants guy, the brother. Oh, I can't think of his name right now. And I don't even know his real name either. But one night in Thousand Oaks, years and years and years ago, I was at like this piano bar and that guy was there. The, the short guy. What's his name? I can't think of his name. Anyway, he was there. And we danced. We slow danced, you guys. Isn't that hilarious? I just remembered that. Mm -hmm. What's his name? Like, 
Justin or Eb Devin or I don't remember some fancy pants name. But yeah, that happened. It was really funny because me, a girlfriend of mine lived down the street from there and there was a really good piano guy. I mean, he was good. I, I don't even remember his name. You guys, my memory is shot. But so we went there to listen to this guy that she knows, you know, the piano guy. He was good. He used to sing that song for me, I Will Survive, because I just broke up with somebody and I was devastated you guys and I mean that was my big that was the big, biggest breakup of my life right so um yeah I was really devastated and so I used to always he used to I, I could play my song <laughs> he play I will survive isn't that, isn't that Gloria Gaynor or something or something I don't know anywho so there's that so if you're new to my channel I do share little tidbits of myself occasionally like that only break you if you let it. So, I just remember that. What was his name? Ralston. I'm trying to think of the guy's name. It's, it, it was a two-syllable Charleston. No. It was like a fancy pants name. You guys are going to know it. Uh-oh. I just can't think of it. I could look it up, but I'm not going to. I'm doing a little dance with this belly paper. So I'm glad to have spent some time with you today. I know it wasn't a lot of time, but I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please subscribe and leave a comment down below. Buy me a cup of coffee and Patreon, that's what I was talking about. I don't want to have to do a, I don't want, if I get enough cups of coffee, I won't have to do a Patreon. Angela, thank you for the first cup of coffee. That was very sweet of you. I really appreciated it. Okay, so now we're going to, let's dry a little bit. We're going to get out some Stabilo. I'm going to leave this uh, out. Like the, I just love this texture, so I'm not going to do anything with it right now. I'm going to get out my Stabilo. Go around the dudes. Go around the dudes. I'm going to use my finger like I say I don't like to do, but I'm too lazy to do anything else right now. I just don't want to do anything else right now. Should I come in a little bit so you can see a little better? Not much to see, but there we go. I remember when I used to go around everything with uh, Posca. I don't like doing that. It ruins everything. Because it doesn't give you the smudgy look that, that I really like. The smudgy look. I like the smudge. There we go. This looks good. Love these shoes. Still trying to think of that guy's name. I want to say Charleston or something like that. Thurston or. I, I mean, I, I don't remember his real name, but I mean, I'm talking about it on the show. I mean, I danced like one dance with him. And um, it was fun. I mean, he seemed like a nice person. Nice guy. I was surprised to see him. But in Thousand Oaks is like a Hollywood bedroom community. There's always somebody, you guys. There's uh, We ran into so many people. I don't even want to drop names. It's ridiculous. It was just part of the whole, if you want to meet Hollywood celebs, go there, I guess. But um, I don't see what the draw is, but yeah, we were just so used to it all the time. You know, it was no big deal. Not funny. Come here and you tell somebody that you met, you know, that I used to, my daughter used to golf with Wayne Gretzky's son and they about have a heart attack. I don't say anything. You know, I just don't say. It's kind of weird. Okay, so there's that. 
چی بارم نیست So you guys go check out this magazine or any magazine. It's more like a book. But go check out this book um, in my Amazon store or, you know, and go to Pinterest and download a bunch of cute little sayings that you might be interested in using um, for your art journals. And uh, Jot usually holds better than that, you guys. It's just not dry and I'm not freaking out. There we go. And, um, yeah. You don't have to do, you don't have to, don't worry, you know. You have the, look at that. I like how that's looking now that it got a little bit of glue on it. It's messy, right? I actually like it better. I actually like it a lot better. There we go. Messing it up, and I love it. And just go, and you don't have to, you can sit in your bed and do this if you don't feel good. You don't have to pull out paint is what I, I guess that's what I'm, my whole thing is you can sit in bed, you don't, and pull out, you can get pretty backgrounds from magazine images too, you know, a lot of the um, ads and stuff have really pretty, um, really pretty um, backgrounds, you know, and so you cut the images out of the backgrounds and you'll be stuck with some really pretty colorful paper to use in your art journals. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. And, um, no. Oh. Pinterest has some great sayings on it. So make sure you check out that. Instead of just cutting from magazines like I used to do, I go to Pinterest and get all my sayings now. I mean, it's like... You know, because you find what you want, you can size them to how you want them. I knew I wanted this to take a whole page, so I left it quite big. You know, there you go. So there we go. I think this is pretty cool. Now I could go around the whole thing, huh? Don't we always? Oh, I'm going to wet my finger a little bit. Oh, yeah. There we go. Oof. I don't usually do that, but, but I, I mean, I usually go around the page. I don't usually wet my finger, but I'm too lazy not to. So I'm going to look at that before that ends up on my carpet. Yes, my art room has carpet. So anyway, let's leave that open. I've got to date this so that we know... Pretty much, I was talking about COVID, you know. I love this page, you guys. It was a lot of fun. I hope you enjoyed it, too. My little, my little Urkels. <laughs> my little Fresh Princes. They're so cute. Here, give him a little bit more definition around this guy. He's got a good face. I like his face. I like his face. A kind face. Okay. There we go. So there you guys have it, okay? It can only break you if you let it. So we've got this, you guys. We are not going to let it break us. We're going to pull up our big girl britches and our big boy pants, and we're going to get through this by, you know, wearing a mask and keeping everybody safe and doing what we need to do. So there we go, DMC, that's my initials. And we're gonna say, what's the date? It's 11, 11, 20, 11, 20, 20. So 
So there we go. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Thanks for hanging out with me and letting me chat at you. And oh, let me show you some other stuff that's in here. There's another one. There's another one. I'm going to stand outside. So if anybody asks, I'm outstanding. I <laughs> every time I still see that I have to giggle. Love this guy, major crush. So I've only done a few pages in here. So again, this is going to be my art journal for my daughter. And if you'd like to see how this book is made, and there's that girl. I always see a girl in here with a long dress. See her profile? Anyway, um, so that's it for the night, for the day. Happy Wednesday. I hope everything is going well with you. Just remember, you guys, it's not the end. We've got this. <sighs> and um, just be well and take care. And I will see you next Wednesday, the day before Thanksgiving for a Christmas fatty patty. That's what I'm planning on doing and I might, and it's my live. So what are you doing? So get out your Christmas fatty patties, you guys, and join me next Wednesday. I don't know what time, but I'll give you some warning on my Facebook group and also in the YouTube uh, community, okay? So thanks again, you guys. Take care, be well, and I love you guys. See you soon. Mm -hmm.